there's a constant struggle between use it. You can use it all, but it doesn't mean you should. Right. I think so I heard a quote one time that said that there's a difference between ideas you think of and ideas you think with. And I think that's really important to understand too with the digital stuff. You have to understand that you're thinking with these programs, and you, I think it gets, that's going back to what you're saying. It's a, it's about understanding what it gives you and thinking properly about that to then understand the product and the idea that you think of. Yeah. And in terms of like the iterative uh, portion of it, I, you're kind of talking about like creating a bunch of crap. Uh, and I, I may be looking at this a little differently than what, what you mean, but uh, I feel like with the design, where I start making progress is when I start producing a lot of crap. I think it was in the Fountainhead when uh, Howard Roark said, my best tool is the trash can. And I use it more than any other architect in this town. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I, I tend to just, one of the most beautiful parts of the project, I think, is at the end where I'll look back and I'll have like this AutoCAD file full of just, here's where my facade was and I drew down like the floor plates and then over here and everything just, it's, it's this chaotic field of sprawl that is all these little different design components that got sent to the laser cutter or got print out. And um, it's, there's a lot of crap in there. There's a lot of pieces that I don't, I don't, I'm not looking to present on the last day but I needed those pieces to get to the last ones. So in a way, I, I almost speed up the crap making process so that I can get to the good stuff. Well, it, so I, I heard a quote the other day that was um, by IDEO. Everybody should know IDEO. He said, fail fast and fail often. And that's kind of what you're saying. But in the end, they create beautiful products.